you see that the video is broke? That the phone's broken? I mean, goddamn. You can see that the screen is broken. You can talk if you want, I guess. Yeah, the screen got broke. So we're going to replace it with a new screen. You just put a knife in there and you kind of twist it a little bit. It'll pop out the clips. Yeah, uh, there's little clips in there that pop. You just do it real gentle. There's some wires up at the top you just be careful with. Sure, it's recording. Yes, Mine. it is. What you're recording it too? <laughs> the bottom's the harder part to put back on when you get to it. So, since the screen is broken anyways, you, can, you should be able just to pop these out. Just pushing. Kind of have to tip it back more to get the bottom ones out because you have clips on the hinges as well. Just kind of take your finger and you can almost just slide it across to pop them out. That trims off. Make sure it's off at this point. Get electrocuted. And you just got four screws in the corner, you gotta. Take out this screwdriver is not gonna. Okay, it's working. Shit. I mean, crap. It fell down there. It says it's recording, right? Mm-hmm. So it's four small screws. You gotta be careful up here. You got the Wi-Fi antennas and the camera, so be careful with that knife, but usually it's, you shouldn't have any issues. The screwdriver's really not fit for this very well. Usually we use a smaller screwdriver. This is the only one I had today. God, that's insane as hell. Did you get that screw down here? Not yet. Where'd it go? It's gone. Well, once we get this one, we'll move it. Uh oh. the video will be us looking for the screws on the ground. There they are. Two little screws. Thanks, baby. Mm -hmm. Good job. Alright, so after you get those four screws out in the corners, one, two, three, four, you just tilt this down, and there's a piece of tape on here. This is duct tape. You won't just find that. There's a piece of clear plastic tape. And all you do with this thing is you gotta push out, push it out on each corner. It's a little receiver harness. So you can take kind of a tool and just push on the sides on each side there. And it should just pop right out. And now you got the old screen out. It's broke. This is the old screen. You just gonna take your new one. Set it down just like how the other one was, and you're gonna take this harness, and it should just slide or slide right into it. Just kind of line it up, and you push it forward. You can pull on the tape there, and then you just tape it down. So that connects it. Do you have any better tape than duct tape? Not with me. Well, duct tape should work just fine, so... Good old duct tape. And then you just line it back up. There's these little plastic you know. holes. And then you'll put the screws in. Right now is probably a good time to test it, just to see if it's working. And I said, it looks like it's working, and I see the mouse on there. 
kind of hard with the bright sun, but it is working. So. All right, so we now I'd recommend tilting it back while you get the screws in. Just take your four screws. How much time are we at? Five nineteen. It's really hard with the screwdriver, it's not made for this. And then let's just tilt this on its back. So basically we're just putting the four screws back in now. Easier when you got a precision screwdriver. This is for this still works. Before you put on the plastic, you're going to want to pull out this protective piece here. You just a little red tab, you just why isn't it going? It, the plastic tab wasn't adhered very well to the Thing, so you might have to take it from another corner. They... Did you just leave it? Or? No. Once we get that plastic around it. Is that the plastic that's on the whole screen? Yeah. I didn't lift the corner up, so it's kind of... You might have to kind of peel it. There you go. And then this should just pull it off. Right there. Mm. That was easy. What do we have for time? 8.48. So you're going to want to tilt this all the way back when you put this on. So that it fits in at the bottom there. So I just... I would clip one the, minute. the hinges in. Yeah, click the hinges in. Should just kind of push in and then the hinges... You do have to push kind of hard down here to... Get it to snap all back in. So you just kind of go around and you clip it back together. Bottom, you do have to push kind of hard down here to really get it to snap. Just be careful that. To break Otherwise, the screen. that's pretty much it. Yep. That's it. We you snapped it in, and that's push we're at done. The, push at the bottom. 
All done. All done. I'll put me in the video. Good job. Turn it on. Did you end it? I was gonna turn it on.